Hey guys, what's going on? It's me, Aaron, aka Mr. AJM3000. Um, this is the first time I'm actually doing a video update in a little while now. I just wanted to update you on what's going on with me um, as an actor. Um, I've been busy, you know. Um, in the summer of 2012 that just passed, I shot a feature film. Um, and it's called Disconsolatus. Uh, I also shot a short film, uh, which is called James Ogilvy, um, and it's really, really um, interesting stories. Both films. Um, I don't want to give too much away, but um, this Consolatus is a sci-fi psycho thriller um, that is based on a story about a young artist from Palestine that is um, infected with this disease um, called this Consolatus. Um, and she's suffering from the symptoms which are depression and she um, encounters seven mysterious characters that are all um, elements of her subconscious so it's a really good story um, I will be sharing more details about when it's uh, finished and released it's in post-production right now the other short film that I was in James Ogilvy is also a really good story it's a thriller um, about a young investment banker um, who returns to Jamaica to, um, you know, uh, settle his dad's financial um, issues and also, um, you know, try to clean up his um, his mess and also make money in the process. But he starts to uncover a lot of deep, dark family secrets uh, that he never knew about um, before he returned to Jamaica. So it's a, uh, it's ma it makes for a good story really good story um, for those of you who don't know I just participated in my first stage play called the Laramie Project ten years later and it was a lot of fun I got the chance to work with Brave New Productions which is a production company that is based out of Montreal uh, I met some really good actors really talented actors from Montreal and from Toronto and we just finished the run it was four shows in three days um, at the Buddies and Bad Times Theater in Toronto and it was a blast and I just wanted to thank everyone that came out and supported it means a lot to me um, especially since it was my first theater production and I just want to send much love to everybody out there who supported me up until now um, with that being said I wanted to get into you know the the aspects of acting and, and for anybody out there that's you know trying to pursue a career in acting um, what struggles you might be going through I hope my advice can help you just based on my personal experience since I've started acting um, stay strong you know don't let people discourage you um, oftentimes you'll notice that when people um, see you doing something that you want to do and you're pursuing it and you you know really are into it and you're devoting your time you're devoting you know your your your, um, your patience you know you're devoting everything to it in, in, in just the hopes of perfecting the craft and you know um, you know um, I'm lost for words but I'm sure you know what I mean don't let people discourage you, you know, because a lot of times people will discourage you when they see you trying to do something that, you know, you want to do. And they are often scared to go after what they really want to do. So therefore, if they can't do it, then you shouldn't do it. So I just want you to, to you know, to remember to have a thick skin and, and to be strong and to keep doing what you're doing, man. You know, I found for me that um, a lot of people that were there before aren't there now since I started acting because you know I don't make any money as an actor and you know who does that no one does that for a living so those people I guess they weren't true friends you know they weren't people that I thought were you know loyal so so be it so what I've done is I've surrounded myself with people that you know are into the same things they are artists or they're actors and they are in the same struggle we are and, and they understand where I'm coming from and they themselves are you know pursuing the same things I'm pursuing so we have a lot more in common so I just wanted to 
to touch on that and to give you guys a little synopsis of what's coming up for me. Um, I auditioned for the New York Conservatory of Dra Dramatic Arts for their summer program, which is four weeks long and it's uh, compressed intensive. So my fingers are crossed that hopefully I make it into that program to not only just get some significant training, but also to meet the right people. Because I'm sure in New York, going to the conservatory, you're going to meet some of the right people if you are pursuing and you are serious about acting. Um, some other things, I am going to be doing a student film next week called Thine is Kingdom, which is going to hit festivals as soon as it's done. Um, a little synopsis, it's a, a dramatic film about a young girl who came from Africa seeking refugee status in Canada. And the film is sort of based around her flashbacks um, after she's detained by customs in the airport and questioned. Um, as she's questioned, each question leads to a flashback and um, it's very powerful. From what I've read so far in the script, it's very powerful. And We start rehearsing uh, on Wednesday, today's Monday. So I don't really have that much time to get prepared, but I mean, that's, act, that's the world of acting. You know, it's, if you're going from one project to another, it's a quick transition. So that's about it for now, but there will be lots more to come. And I hope you guys stay tuned. Subscribe to my channel. Tell your friends about my channel. You can follow me on Twitter at Mr. AJM3000. You can like my Facebook fan page, AJ Fan Access page. And you can also add me personally, Aaron Monroe, on Facebook. Um, just want to say thank you all to everyone who supported me up until now and will continue to support me in the future. This one's for you. There will be more of these vlog updates coming soon, so... Stay tuned. Peace.